We regard it as a demonstration of a more enjoyable way of living in an old industrial part of a city. It is a model, an exemplar of a new mode of urban organization. To re-identify and become a real piece of urban renewal. This is something to do with urban scale and that industrial sites are somehow forthright and honest. When a city becomes big, when a city becomes an urban region, the scale has got to be increased so that it matches the scale of the urban region. The realities of our working life are going to be traffic, noise, air pollution, vandalism, lack of quality. At the turn of the century, architects dreamed of garden cities. London really has never faced up to being more than a collection of villages. Society at the moment asks architects to build these new homes for them. But, I mean, this may be really stupid. We may have to rethink the whole thing. It may be that we should only be asked to, to repair the roofs and add the odd bathroom to the old industrial houses and just leave people where they are to smash it up in complete abandon and happiness so that nobody has to worry about it anymore.